ఆడిట్ మనకి థర్డ్ మనకి థర్డ్ బీకంలో ఆడిట్ టాపిక్స్లో మనకి సెకండ్ యూనిట్లో ఉన్న టాపిక్ వచ్చేసి టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్ ఈ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్స్ సో డిఫరెంట్ డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్స్ ఉన్నాయి ద లాట్ ఆఫ్ ఫోర్ డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్స్ ఆర్ దేర్ ద ప్రెసెంట్ యూఆర్ డిస్కసింగ్ వీ ఆర్ నౌ వీ ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కసింగ్ అబౌట్ ద మెయిన్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ టాపిక్ ఆన్ దట్ మెయిన్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ టాపిక్ అండ్ మెయిన్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ బేస్ మెయిన్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్స్ ఆర్ నౌ వీ డిస్కసింగ్ ఇన్ దిస్ టాపిక్స్ ఓకే నౌ ఐ గోట్ ద ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ ద ఆడిట్ వీ కెన్ డివైడ్ ద త్రీ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్ ద త్రీ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్ దట్ ఈస్ ద ఫస్ట్ థింగ్ ఈస్ ద బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఓనర్షిప్ సెకండ్ వన్ ఇస్ ద బేస్డ్ ఆన్ టైమ్ అండ్ థర్డ్ వన్ ఇస్ ద బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఆబ్జెక్టివ్స్ మనకి ఆడిట్ ని మూడు రకాలుగా మనం వర్గీకరించాం ఆ మూడు రకాలలో మొదటిది వచ్చేసి బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఓనర్షిప్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ టైమ్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఆబ్జెక్టివ్ ఈ విధంగా మనం వర్గీకరించిన తర్వాత మనం ఆ టాపిక్స్ మనం గమనించినట్లయితే ద ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ ద ఫస్ట్ వీ హ్యావ్ గో ఫర్ ద బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఓనర్షిప్ ద బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఓనర్షిప్ మీన్స్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఓనర్షిప్ ఆడిట్స్ ఇస్ సో డిఫరెంట్ డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆడిట్స్ ఆఫ్ దే ఇట్ విల్ బి రిలేటెడ్ అండ్ ఇట్ విల్ బి డిపెండ్స్ అపాన్ ద ఓనర్షిప్ బికాస్ విల్ కాల్ అన్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ఓనర్షిప్ ఆడిట్ ద ఫస్ట్ థింగ్ ఇస్ దట్ సోల్ ప్రొటెక్టర్షిప్ ద సోల్ ప్రొటెక్టర్షిప్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద మీనింగ్ ఆఫ్ సోల్ ప్రొటెక్టర్షిప్ ఆల్రెడీ వి నో అబౌట్ ద సోల్ ప్రొటెక్టర్షిప్ సోల్ ప్రొటెక్టర్షిప్ మీన్స్ ఎస్పెషలీ విచ్ బిజినెస్ ఆర్ టు బి డన్ బై ద వన్ పర్సన్ ఆర్ అ సోల్ ట్రేడర్ దట్ విల్ కాల్ అస్ అన్ సోల్ ట్రేడ్ బిజినెస్ ఇన్ ద సేమ్ మ్యానర్ ద సోల్ ప్రొటెక్టర్షిప్ ఆల్సో when he maintained the audit with the own efforts with the own knowledge he was to do the all the audit or any of the accounts or in particular period okay the particular period lo ye vyakti ite sondanga tanaku taane aa lekkal anithi kuda audit chestunnatlaite dani sole proprietorship ani antaru the second thing is the partnership forms the partnership form means two or more than two or more than people doing the one business that will called as a partnership firms in the same manner partnership firms they have to know and they have to go for the check of all the accounts in particular period that person that means the partnership to know about the accounts of facts accounts of facts and accounts of any of the problem or arise in the uh, firms because the partnership forms are to be maintained the audit with the efforts okay the auditor can take the place and do the all of the accounts to check and to verify the all of the accounts that will be called in partnership forms audit the third one companies the companies means according to the companies act must and should they have to go for the audit by the auditor or the chartered accountant okay the chartered accountant can uh, can do the audit in particular uh, period or particular uh, stages okay because the company's access according to the company's access the who the person or the chartered accountant and licensed and registered licensed and registered company account people they must be elected the auditor and uh, they have to go for the audit audit purpose okay because the audit is one of the main important for the companies to know the accounting situation and also the facts of the account and any frauds of the accounts like this. these are all will be uh, these are all will be checked by only the auditor because that we will call as a uh, company's use and that is will call as a company's audit the next one is the trust audit trust audit means for example we will take the so different different uh, organizations non trading organizations are there but every non trading organization will be uh, registered by that registered as a trust because the trust also they have to maintain all of the different types of accounts that accounts also will be audited by the auditor that will be called as a trust audit trust audit okay next is the cooperative societies the cooperative societies these are all will be some of the main important it depends upon the ownership here sole proprietorship sole trader is the owner partnership partnership partners are the owners companies company owners are the owners <coughs> trust trustees are the owners cooperative society cooperative members are the owners like that the same manner the cooperative societies also they have to go for the audit of all the accounts by the members and also the elected one auditor by the members he was to be do the all of the accounts to verify and check by check and it will be any of the frauds and any of the problems are to arise in from the account they have to go prepare for the audit report by the auditor only it will be useless for the cooperative members and they have to take the decisions for the future activities 
In the same manner, the last one is the government department. The government departments, the lot of government sector, the government sectors are there. In the government sector, lot of departments are there. The every department they have to go for the maintaining of the different different records. The same manner, we have to go ourselves in our SKP government degree college. Also, they have to maintain. This is also one of the government organization. This government organization, what the fees are to be taken from the students? What are the fees? And what are the salaries are there? And what are the funds are there? Like that, these are all they have to maintain in the ledgers. And finally, and here why are the quarterly or three years ones? They have to go for the audit. The government departments also they have to go for the audit purpose because it will be useful and it will be take the decision purpose in future. Okay, these are all the based on ownership audits. Okay, the especially in the. <coughs> In the every company, the companies are must ensure they have to go for the audit, and partnership forms also they have to go for the audit every year, and also the corporate society trustees. These are all the main important, uh, important, and it will be more important to give the audit. Okay, this is the uh, based on ownership of audits. Okay, the next thing we go to the another topic that is the based on time. The based on time is one of the main important for the. Audit reports and for the purpose of the audit. The first is the interim audit. The interim audit means it is a depends upon the time. Interim audit means it is a depends upon the time for the six months or the three months or year ones. It is a when it will be depends upon the time can do the audit by the auditor that will be called as an interim audit. The next is the final audit. The final audit it will be done by the every every financial year ending okay every financial year ending all the companies all the organizations or any of the traders they have to go for to take the financial year the finally end of the end of the year and <coughs> end of the year it will be go for the final audit the final audit will be done on the 31st march uh, 31st march and it will be go for the Next year, a financial year. The next is the continuous audit. Continuous audit means in the large scale sectors, the large scale sectors, the large scale sectors and corporate companies, they have to go for to uh, take the audit every month. It is a continuous audit. It will be done the internal auditors, internal auditors. Under the then the auditor will do a lot. Continuous audit, audit, any, man, internal audit, any, continuous audit, any, and that one. The continuous auditing is depends upon the monthly wise, the three months wise, six months wise, and nine months wise, and year wise. Or monthly wise also. <coughs> monthly wise also they have to done the audit because that will be called as a continuous audit. Next one is the balance sheet audit. The balance sheet audit is a mainly related with the assets and liabilities. Only the auditor can concentrate or concentrate on the Assets and liabilities. <coughs> what are the assets are there? What are the liabilities are there? What are the uh, what are the, the position of the assets and what are the position of liabilities? They have to go for to check all of the all of the assets and liabilities related things to be related with the assets and liabilities. On the amounts will be checked by the auditor that will call as a balance sheet audit. This is these are all will be based upon the time. The based upon the time audit. What are the interim audit, final audit, continuous audit, balance sheet audit? Balance sheet, balance sheet only for the short period. And continuous audit it will be taken from the every month or price or monthly wise or three months wise, etc. The next final audit only will be for the after the twelve month we go for the audit. Interim audit only for the six months and the three months audit will be called as an interim audit. Next we go to the based on objectives. The based on objectives. The based on object, the first topic is that independent and external audit. Especially the companies or organizations, lot of objectives are there. But uh, every organization, they different objectives are there. So for example, our non-trading concerns they have for they, they have different objectives. Trading concerns or they have different objectives. Okay, the small scale sector they have different objectives like that. <coughs> the different different objectives are there because. Based upon the objectives, also they have to go for the audit. Because of that, the first one is the independent and external audit. 
independent and external audit means especially who the person ought to be maintain the firm who the person ought to be maintain the accounts of the organization independently they have to go for the check that purpose of to take the decision for future activities because when he done by self he he done and uh, he done the uh, himself automatically will be called as an independent audit atanantha atanu lekkam check chesi aa lekkam check chesina tarvata atanu edaina anni lekkalu anni check chesukodani independent audit ani antam and the next external audit also alaanti lekkalu for example the small scale sector and the some of the people they don't know about the how to check the accounts at that time they have to go for the external audit they have to go for the external audit the any of the person or identified or licensed by the chartered accountant he was to come and check the accounts that we call as an external audit the next thing is that internal audit internal audit what is the meaning of internal audit especially the large scale sectors the large scale sector they have to maintain the own auditors they have to maintain the own auditors that own auditors they have to go for to check all the accounts every month or every 15 days purpose or every day hours okay every day hours they have to check for different different uh, all of the departments it will be called as an internal audit internal audit is a main important important objective means that to check the verification of the accounts within the time because of that the some of the organization and some of the large sectors they have to elected by the elected auditors by the resolution board of directors or the owners owners gaani board of directors gaani pratyekanga vennu ennukoni vaalu sondanga auditorlanu neminchukoni vaala dwara account nu check chesinatlaite dan internal audit ani antaru the next thing is cost audit the cost audit is not a more given priority for the present days but the cost audit is especially to increase or decrease the <coughs> decrease the cost of the variances the cost of the different different uh, expenses on the production expenses production expenses takinchadaniki ee manunna edamo cost expenses takinchadaniki edaina nirnayalu tisukovali ante they have to go for the cost audit okay the next is the tax audit the tax verification purpose is there when we have to pay the government taxes to the government at the time then we don't know about the how to how to uh, fill up that how to maintain the all of the accounts uh, all of the accounts and finally we have to prepare the tax file the tax file will be checked by the tax auditor the next is the government audit the government audit is especially for the government sector people and the government organizations okay who the person or organizations are to be maintained by the government automatically the government will take a place for to uh, for the audit purpose okay for example <coughs> government colleges government institutions these are all will be, uh, will, will be audited by the government only the government takes a place uh, to check the all of the records of the government sector that will be called as a government audit the next uh, secretary the secretary means it is also it will be rules and regulations by the law rules and regulations by the law i will be checked by the officials of the organizations and officials of the government sector they have to go for to maintain the secretarial tax the secretarial audits these are all we call as a types of audits is a main important question for the examination and also it is a useful for the uh, future purpose also this is the topic of types of audits